guys, it's Danny again, and uh, I'll be doing week 49's decoration video today. Um, I figured that I'm so used to filming with my iPhone 5 when it comes to tutorials and this angle that I'll probably continue to just film my tutorials with my iPhone, and then with every other kind of video, I'll use my new camera, which is HD. I know it's probably best if I use the HD camera for this, but until I can figure out what I can do with like my tripod and I figure I'm gonna need an extension arm for the tripod in order to have it placed right above here directly so that you guys will have like a better view of what I'm doing but until then I'm just gonna stick to the, what I'm used to um so yes I am getting the hang of filming every day and uploading every day so I hope you guys will appreciate this uh, stay tuned at the very end because I have some important news about the giveaway so, this is what it looks like. Well, this is what I chose for this week. I didn't want to do Christmas Christmassy stuff yet because I want to save that for the week of Christmas, like I did with Halloween and like I did with Thanksgiving. I kind of just for Halloween used Halloweeny colors, but not specifically about Halloween and used that for the week of Halloween. Uh, Thanksgiving, I did the same thing, just fall colors and then and then like Thanksgiving colors the week of Thanksgiving. So, I chose this really nice snowflake um, washi tape. And this is, um, here, let me show you. These two came in a set from Recollections by Michaels. So that's what it looks like. And then this is an empty slim roll that I have that, um, it's just like a thin tape that I used in the middle to match with the rest. And then what I plan to do is after the washi tapes, I plan on using the pink to ink. So this is the Memento in Rosebud. Let's see if this will focus. Okay, Memento in Rosebud. And I'll be using my Muji stamp, as always, to use the pink ink. So that way I have this to match the green, this to match the pink, and then I will either write in blue or I'll use sticky notes that are blue for my special events. Like, I have something here. So, um, I'm just going to leave that and then erase it later and stick a sticky note on it later. So I'm going to move this to the side and show you guys what I did. So, because this is a very thick, or should I say a wide roll, sorry for the shadow, it's the lighting. Because if I turned off my lamp, it still has a shadow anyway, so I'm just going to turn it back on. Okay, so, this is a very wide tape. So what I did was I used my trim, um, my Fiskars paper trimmer, and I trimmed that in half. So, I'm going to grab that piece. That I already trimmed right here and as always I place that right on the bottom can you guys see this yeah okay I'm just gonna place that as best as I can As always, be very careful when peeling washi tape because you don't want it to take the paper with it. Okay, that's fine. Let's flip it over, trim off the excess. And then what I did next was I used this up top, so I'm going to flip this upside down. Grab this. Line it up as best as you can. And I'm trying that new technique. <laughs> okay. Flip it over. Trim it. flip that back around and then what I do next is I use that thin washi tape right in the middle because that's what I like to do um, and then when it comes to this I kind of just I don't roll it I just place it as best as I can because it's just I don't know it's simple enough that you can do it without having to do it with any certain technique Just like that. Trim. Okay. So 
So the washi tape is done. Now it's time to ink. If I can get the washi tape off. Okay. Ah, I should have inked this page first. That way it would cut down the video, but oh well, I forgot. So dab. See, the memento ink dewdrops are like really hard. They're not like the Versa Magic chalk inks. And then it makes me worried that like the ink isn't on. I don't know. Let's just let's just see. It's like really hard to dab. Alright. Not there. Place it as best as you can. And press down hard. I need I I really do need to get a mouse pad like Jennifer does when she stamps things. Oh, okay, good. So the ink is on it. <laughs> okay, dab again. It's just it just feels like rock hard. I don't know. It's hard to explain. Okay. That's really awkward. <laughs> you guys can probably read what it says. Oh well. It's it wasn't for anything in particular, just so you guys know, it's just for birth control. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with me, I swear. Okay. Alright. Now on the other side. My nails are still chipped. <laughs> okay. okay, and again. I really should have done one page already. Sorry. Almost done with the inking. I'm so sorry that it's taking so long. Okay. Okay. Last one. Okay. Now, please remember to use a baby wipe and wipe it down for the sake of the video and the length of the video. I'm not going to do it here. So, decorating. I have these that I got on sale from Michael's last Christmas. These are really great. They're like the Deco Rush Tape Runners. And what they are, they're just like um, whiteout runners, but with like a design. Like a design tape. So, a deco tape. So, as you can see on the bottom of this one, the three designs are here. And then... The three designs of these, this set is here. Luckily, I got these on sale. Now, as you can see in this one, there's a set of snowflakes one that are the same exact colors as the washi tape that I chose. So I'm going to open that up and use it because it's literally like fate. I'm so sorry. I'm making all this noise. Forgive me, forgive me. Come on, come on. Oh, typical Annie dropping something again. All right. Oh well. Okay, now the thing about this, this is the actual tape runner. This is just a refill. So I have to figure out how to put this into here. Let's see. 
Oh, okay. Now how do I get this one out? Oh, you guys can see what I'm doing. How do I get this one out? Okay, let's see. This was like this. Oh, okay. There we go. There it goes. Okay, that one's out. You have to take this one off. Alright. Is that not how it goes? This is actually really difficult. I think I totally did that wrong. Okay, there we go. Let's go, Annie, let's go. Okay. Oh, it's a clicker. Okay, anyways, now that it's in, <laughs> what I'm gonna do with it is I think I'm gonna put it right here under the word December. So. Which side do I do it? No? Is that not how you do it? Okay, I can't figure it out, so I'm just gonna do that at the end because this video is starting to get long. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna Use these stickers because the colors match. And I'm going to put this guy right here. These are 3D, just so you guys know. So they're going to take up some room. Uh, I'm going to put this snowflake. Right here, or actually, right here on the Sunday. Okay, so I'm just gonna do that. I might change it up because I didn't realize these are really, really 3D, so I might change that up. So this is what it looks like so far. Sorry, I couldn't figure out the deco rush thingy. Um, I will probably do some more stickers later on, so uh, check out my Instagram if you want to see how these pages will turn out. Um, I'm not even going to bother putting them into my Kiki K because I know I'm going to change it up as soon as I'm done with this video. Uh, but, speaking of the giveaway, your comments were all so wonderful and I loved reading every single one of them. And um, some of you guys mentioned that you don't even ha have an Instagram account and you were curious as to whether you could still enter the giveaway. Well, because you guys are so wonderful, I figure I'm just going to have two giveaway packs. One for YouTube, dis uh, YouTube, my YouTube subscribers, and the second one will be for my Instagram followers. So, basically, if you're a YouTube um, subscriber and you commented it, you're in for that. If you're just an Instagram follower and you commented, you're in on that. But just know that you still only have one entry. If you happen to do both, that's great, but I'm not going to be able to check every single one of you guys and see who is both and who is one to give you guys an extra... Um, entry. So just to be fair, I'm sorry, I'm just gonna choose one winner for my YouTube subscribers and choose one winner for my Instagram followers. So I'll have two prize packs. They won't be exactly the same like as what you saw in the last video of the prizes. They're gonna be different prizes. But um, just know that there will be two winners. So thank you, thank you, thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye!